Okay, so what I'm going to do right now is I am going to take the lens out and take the uh, telemetric converter out for you to see the difference in colors and the difference in distances. Okay, so I am taking right now, uh, this is ISO 200. I'm going to bring it down to 100 for the best possible image. And I am going to take out the teleconverter. Sometimes the camera doesn't like it, you know, it can work with, uh, with, with it in manual. And you can take the teleconverter off for me to do a, like, a, uh, a, 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 a compare. This is the farthest thing that this, no, this is not the farthest thing that this goes. Let me, let me put my light on it. This is the, this is the, farthest thing that this goes. This is like the sharpest it goes in the, in, this is the sharpest that it goes in the lowest position. So if that would be 650 times 2. That's the sharpest. So that is the sharpest. I'm going to zoom it down in to the farthest that it goes. Remember this is a video at ISO 100. Farthest that it goes and this is probably the sharpest that it goes. Sharpest. You can find better, like better examples, like I showed you in the inner in, in a, in a, in a, before. You see something more sharp, like the letters. You can you can read full letters. You can see very good things. I'm going to take the lens out. Let me give you a little bit of more examples here. Um, you can see. You can see. You can see. You can see. And you can see that. And God is the best. God is the best that it, there exists. The best in the existence. The best thing that exists. Or the best thing that exists. <laughs> that's in ISO 100. That's why you, you see it a little bit. Of, a little bit of so, that's the farthest it goes. Now let me check out the lens. So the lens is going to be taken. Moment. I want to, okay, I want to take the lens off. Uh, it's off. You see white. I'm going to take out the teleconverter. Let me put this in my neck. So, um, I am taking off the teleconverter. So a little bit of a job here because you have to take out the teleconverter and you have to take out the um, the, tamp, the T mount. Uh, it's no hassle. You just put it back in and you put the camera in. So let's see how the camera looks without the teleconverter. Put that in. Put it out. There we go. So now we have the camera without the teleconverter. So you see that we had, I showed you the Coors Light logo there. This is the farthest at end, and what set my hold is right this is the farthest that it goes. Basically the same, yeah. If not, you know, you don't lose a lot of image. If you use the teleconverter, I thought that you would. And you basically don't lose a lot of image. You know, it is pretty, pretty, pretty awesome product itself is very good. I'm going to show you the houses. This is the farthest that the lens goes. It's 1,300. And by looking at the houses, you do lose a little bit of image, but it's not that bad. You know, it's not like you're going to lose a knife. Do a horrible, horrible, horrible job. You know, it, because the pictures that I've seen of, of this product online, they're not like the, the, the best. You know, you, they just show you like birds flying, like nature photography, which you can do very good, nice work with nature photography if you if you do a good job with it. You know, you have to drop the ISO, have a good balancing, have a good tripod, or have a good steady hands or arms. If you can do this with your arms and do do a good job. See, it, it is a very good lens. This is the Bauer 650 one uh, 1300 without the teleconverter. So I want to show you a little bit of where I'm at. I am playing with the ISO a little, with the uh, uh, shutter, this is 
the shutter speed. It is the button of the shutter speed. I don't know how, how it's called in video, but it does work with, with the uh, illumination here. So I'm going to show you a little bit of where I'm at. I'm covering a bodyboarding contest. And this is the lens without the teleconverter. Let me see how, how far it goes and how good it looks. So I do recommend you to buy this product. You know, manually for you to work it, you need a little like a day, a day of experience for you to, for you to know exactly what you what you want. A good tripod for it. Uh, you would need a good tripod that will let you maneuver your camera uh, around. You can do it in your hands. It's not a, you know, you, I, I've done it actually with my hands and it is quite, it is actually better. It is better in your hands. You need to have a little bit of patience. It is very good. That's the, the place where we're doing all this. Yellow, last wave of yellow, 5.50. Yellow now is in first. Red, here in second. Red needs a 4.01 to first. Uh, I'm actually first priority, red, second priority, like a little mountain here. Yeah, so the lens actually does have a, it has very good image. Doesn't distort, doesn't distort it around the borders that much. You know, it does good, it does do good imaging. You know, very, very good, very good. And God says hi. God says that He loves you and or she loves you very much. He, she, shy, show, whatever. God loves us very much. He is. God is the best thing that exists in the whole, whole, whole existence of the 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 whole existence. God is the best. He loves us. God loves us very much. God is the best. There we go. That is the power. So I hope you guys have a very, very nice day and I hope you like this little compilation of the uh, uh, you know the, the, the lens with and without the teleconverter I hope it helps with you buying it because it, it is very good I do recommend it I haven't seen a product that is similar to it you know you do have like fixed focused lenses or you do have in the Canon in the Canon case or in the other you know I don't I have I, 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 you know my basic my you know my knowledge is more in, in onto Nikon's but I do know that that, that I, Canon has like uh, like uh, 400 uh, telemetric lenses and all that but this is a good buy it is a very good buy actually I, I, I am interested in, in buying like a, teles a telescope for you know the ones that you can actually see Saturn and to see how you can actually take like pictures with it because you know if you can like take a picture of Saturn, you, I do expect that if you're like in a, in a football field or in a baseball field, you would be able like to see something very good. Unfortunately, you know, not everybody's that enthusiastic in uploading a video to of, of it actually working on a field instead of at, on, on astronomy. Because I would love to see how it works. Because you know, a big. You know, it's like one thousand, two thousand dollars for something you can see like a spot on the moon. You know, it's, it's it would be interesting in looking at something like that. Last wave of red. Last of red. There we go. Five nine zero. Baby, Last of red. Five nine zero. Like the belly. Yellow. Six. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Marcia. Marcia. Six five zero. Situation. Yellow in first. Red in second. Red in second. Need a six one one. Six one five. Oh yeah. Hope you have a nice night. Thank you.